JT on the puck is going to be key in catching the back line. That's their best way of jumping on the squishy heroes. So a lot is riding on the back of the puck to start these fights. Assuming you're out of vision, of course. Yeah, it's uh, still a slightly better time for Somnus. I think he has wasted a lot of flies. Why? Regen, you Surrounded. Bot lane. He's going to be in trouble. Kaka has attacked him active and FY needs some help, but nobody's willing to help the man out. So Kaka will be the one to claim first blood in this game number one. And Fly Fly, Crypt Swarm won't be enough. Somnus, he does get a Fairy Fire off just in the nick of time. He also committed his stick charges. But uh, Kaka, he's just really giving it to the way of LTD. That's definitely how you want it. Like, the Medusa is a super greedy pick that just takes so long to come online. It's not like LGD's lineup is quite ready to, to fight back as well. So this is the moment for IG to really force it into them. So first exorcism nets them a kill on a support shadow demon. Not the best first use. Oh, so you actually think FY did that on purpose? Oh yeah, definitely. Top Big lane. brain plays. Bot lane, old 11. Gonna go down, I don't think he did that one on purpose. It was again Kaka <laughs> rotating in on the task. So perhaps Fly Fly giving him the call over and he's got exorcism up in about 20 seconds, so. Won't find the, oh. the uh, rune though, and now Rolling Thunder Chalice just wants to commit all the way. If there is a Spirit Siphon on Chalice, and in fact he gets him up the hill now. They may have to settle on trying to just kill Kaka instead. Though, Ollie could not save. His Chalice just did too much damage with that Swashbuckle. Chalice could be uh, the target of a gank attempt. He does go into JT. X Nova shows himself as well, but now Emo pops Metamorphosis. A double Dream Coil. It's the dream for Emo, and he does find Chalice, as well as X Nova, who has no way out of that situation. And with that meta, you are right next to that T1 top tower. I believe it's time to push. Yeah, it certainly should be. Fly is caught out, though. Could be in trouble down by. Looks to be in a hell of a lot of trouble. Old Levin. Commits the Roar and the Beastmaster gets a very, very important kill. IG seem to just accept the fact that Fly Fly is dead and they still find the T1 top, so it's not all bad. Though Old Lemon's still going. Kaka gonna be in trouble. Snowball towards the Ancients, but he's still so slow. Shards will not block Old Eleven out. They do find another kill. I think they're literally just gonna hold on to it until it's just about to die. Fact, JT. Does juke out the stun coming out from X Nova. They're still looping around here, LGD. It's like Kaka has been controlled up by Old Eleven, so they will be able to claim the task. And perhaps now LGD could try and force in the mid lane. Yeah, they're in prime position. They've got a lot of damage with X Nova and Old Eleven around, so the auras are in play. It's very easy for the Medusa to start hitting hard at this point with this kind of draft. FY setting up on the Terrorblade top lane. Emo was left alone, and this could be really oh. bad for IG. Emo taking so much damage from those Shadow Demon Illusions. He does sunder the Illusion eventually. Dream Coil is also going to be there on Old Eleven, who does have Roar available, just waiting for his opportunity, but JT does jaunt out of there. Chalice is still chasing him down. X Nova looking for a stun. It does get avoided by JT. They still continue to chase. In fact, a very nice swashbuckle from Chalice, but now X Nova does go down, but they've also lost Ollie on the side of IG, but they are dropping very fast on that IG team. Oh. They do lose Kaka as well in Emo. Still trying to run, but he is completely surrounded in that tree line. He shouldn't be able to get out of this. They do eventually find him with Somnus on the Dusa. And Fly Fly, he showed up for a while, but he has to leave immediately. So not only do you lose a huge team fight, but you lose that gold from that T1 mid. Maybe they'll make up for it if they could spot out Somnus, but X Nova is around the area. In fact, they're going to try and jump in here. JT going straight after that Vengeful Spirit. He is healing up a little bit, but eventually he does get taken out. Somnus is alone at the bot lane, and they should know that. Fly Fly got ganked up a top lane. The be next best thing now for IG is perhaps to aim for that bot tier one with the extra system. You're still going to have it when you respawn. You won't. You do have Metamorphosis up as well. So IG can actually play quite nicely oh, Emo. here. Purged up by FY again, and Somnus is just not even farming on Medusa. He's just going to fight. 
Emo does get the oh. Sunder off on Somnus, but again, he has the Mana Shield. Oli is already dead, but he got the False Promise off, and now they continue to try and go on Somnus, but Emo is gone, and now Kaka is a sitting duck on the task and Fly Fly. He came in as well with the Exorcism. Oh, oh man, oh man. LGD. How often is it you see a Medusa? I mean, Somnus just looked unaffected after the Sunder. It just did nothing to him. X Nova. Looking to try and get a swap off here onto Fly Fly. Chalice. Threatening the Rolling Thunder, but eventually cancels it off. Well, I don't know if you want to play these games with LGD. They will go in, and there's Chalice. He does play the Rolling Thunder. On to the Puck JT. Can he jaunt away? No. The roar is out from old Eleven. Somnus will pick up the kill once again, and now it's the mid tier two tower. This does give some time for Emo to farm up, but it's not quite fast enough. He's still waiting for his ultimate orb for the Manta style, and even then, that, that just can't compare to how hard oh, Medusa Emo. hits. He tried to back out in time. They knew exactly where he was. It's just the Hawks from old Eleven. Constantly giving out vision. You already can't kill this uh, Medusa anyway. Not to mention Somnus is about to finish that Eye of Scardy. Oof. Yeah. T3 goes down fairly easily and... Well, Emo, he does pick up a Manta now, but he's just split pushing the bot wave. Understanding he can't defend this top Rax with his team. He doesn't get to that level 15 mark though, so no added talent for him with that tomb that he did just uh, just use for himself. Snowball, Dream Core from JT onto two. They try to take down old 11, but now the Stone Gaze JT, he's falling very, very low. He does jaunt Ooh. forward. Somnus just doing so much damage in the middle of all this. Fly Fly about to fall, and Ollie, he has gone down. There goes Fly Fly, now Emo trying to fight back. He goes after X Nova, but the roar comes out from old 11. The buybacks are out from IG, but the GG's been called. They know they can't come back. Oh man. 22 minutes. LGD. With a Medusa. With a Medusa. And a position one Pango. Man, this is some old, old school strat, right? Like just stacking Aorus and picking a Medusa for really strong physical damage and presence early on. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nagas are. All right. Ties in. We'll team play. fight, uh, yeah, pull back, team fight, go in, set up for your AA. But IG kind of look like they're just fine with a slower pace of game. They know they come online a bit earlier, so just safely farming up doesn't hurt them too bad. FY. Perched up. Looks like he is pretty screwed here, unless Old Eleven can do something about it. But no, they do find the first blunt. Good start for IG in the end, and in fact, they might even find Old Eleven who just. Really tried to help out a, a lost cause, and yeah, he's gonna lose his life as well. Fly, fly, he does find a double kill. And of course, Razor just has too much of a good time with Static Link. You have to hope, though, that this free space for your Naga will pay off. We'll see if it Ooh, does. JT. Speaking of the Naga, FY actually rotated down bottom and helped set up a kill. In fact, he claims the kill on the Shaman. FY and X Nova just waiting for the right opportunity to try and go on Emo. And Emo does spot him out, pops the trap, but there's going to be X Nova right behind him. The cold feet will latch on. Emo oh. really has no way out of this and does go down. There will be a rotation from Fly Fly and Kaka now. They try to go on to Somnus and claim that big kill, and Somnus will actually end up going down to Kaka on that disruptor. They also get X Nova in the kinetic field, but he'll just TP out of there. Though no, Glimpse was available on Kaka, so they will go ahead and they'll find a secondary pickup. I, you know, although you lose Emo on that TA, I love the fact that, uh, that IG are being very aggressive. They don't feel confident in defending this T1 mid. They'll let it go down. Yeah, it's a major piece of control going IG's way, so that does give him all the control in this jungle, and they catch all the Lovin out as well. Yeah, they do. Glimpse is going to be there with the Static Storm, not allowing him to go into Dragon form. And he's still going to try and make a run for it. Old 11 is... Plasma Field should connect, and yeah, Firefly does secure the kill. And IG, they, they continue. They, they're doing okay. It's nice armor, it's good damage, and it's some int. Give him a little bit more in his mana pool to play with. Yeah. 
Smoke is going to be there on Somnus. Can he get out in time? No, the Roar is going to be there. They have the glimpse anyway from Kaka if they needed it. And with Emo's Deso up, it seems as though they can go for the Roshan play. Chalice is there. He has Song, but he's going to be quick. And I don't think he's actually going to go for it. He's just going to let it be. They just didn't have anything to scout it out in time. At this point, the DK's died so much that I don't think he really minds copying one for the team. Yeah, hold 11, sitting at 4.7k net worth. He's going to throw a Dragon Tail out. Understands he's probably going to die. Oh. It's the funny thing about the DK though, right? You can kill him over and over again. But ultimately, when it comes down to it, he can still do what he's meant to do, which is push down towers in Dragon form. Like, it, it, yeah. Yep, it, it certainly is. Like, he's still working himself towards a blink at a decent pace. I mean, it's not amazing, it's not even good, but it's still going to be up, and that's all they fine, need. Fine. Nice Serpent Ward's blocked there in the tree line. Ice Blast gonna fly through, fly, fly, he's done four low. They do not have any more Static Storm. Somnus, who are you looking for? Song is gonna be there, he has Sonic Wave, he just wants to line it up perfectly, and it looks like he will not throw it out yet, he just waits. Now the Sonic Wave does come out, connecting on Kaka, the roll will be there on Somnus. Fly, fly, he'll come back in as well, straight onto Chalice, but it looks bad for IG, they're starting to fall very, very low. There goes your Aegis on Emo. Old Eleven looking for the backside. Couldn't find anyone yet. FY meanwhile trying to control up Emo with the Hex. Now the Shackle. And that's all they really wanted. They can try to chase now. They probably won't catch anyone else from the side of IG. But they literally just wanted Emo. They're just going to take an objective for their time. And are they really going to go for a tier 3? They still have time. The Roshan's still being taken. Yeah, they dropped the ward straight away. There's the Aegis being taken now by Emo. You're going to take a substantial amount of damage on that tier 3. IG, Sonic Wave. Oh. Connecting on Kaka. Emo now jumps in straight onto old 11. He will find the DK. Song is out, but unfortunately, Emo is BKB'd up, so X Nova does die anyway. You lost your DK, you lost your AA. You left the Surf Awards, though. So that T3 tower is just almost dead. They mitigate their losses and still find an objective, although Chalice, if they find this kill, that's really big. Yeah, he doesn't have TP or Song. And he is way out of position now. Chalice trying to run, but he should def... Well, oh, Kaka's the one to spot him out. Glimpse him back. Yeah, he's definitely dead. JT won't even waste his time. And that makes it very well worth for IG now. So he's just about a thousand gold off. Once that's up, you can really just take away a lot of the potency of IG's draft, whether or not you focus on the Razor or the TA. Oh, Somnus. Does manage to blink away. Kaka may still look for him. In fact, he just settles on X-Nova. And Old Eleven jumps oh. in. Somnus jumps in as oh. well. Sonic Wave thrown out. Static Storm was panically thrown out by Kaka, and it does not pan out. He did not really put the kinetic field down. And Somnus finds a double. And they just knew the kinetic field was on cooldown at the time, so he couldn't really lock anyone in. So he has a lot more presence and control in the middle of these fights. And that Heaven's Halberd for Old Eleven, 300 gold away now. So it's going to be up super soon, Oh, Speaking of Old Eleven, Flyfly Fly on the Razor does go down, and Somnus will just put a lid on that. Yeah, on Chalice, that's really big. That's going to mitigate a lot of the sustain. IG has with their Oracle. You're not going to get as much value from that. And Chalice Emo should be a bit careful. Yeah, he's just running into all of them. Uh, Emo pops his BKB. They're going to go. They don't understand what's going on here. What is Chalice up to? He does get muted now. That's an agony of Static Storm, but they can't take him down in time. Somnus is here. They do finally find him, but Emo is trapped up in the Serpent Wards. JT's being controlled. Oh. Ice Blast flies through. Ollie will survive the onslaught that was Somnus, but Somnus wants Emo. He does manage to blink out in time. And ultimately, it's a it's a two for... Yeah, it was a two for one trade. They got the Aegis. They forced the buyback out from Kaka. They lose Chalice in the process. And now, Glimpse. Huh? X Nova may also go down, but Old Eleven will find a trade for the team. Oh. Huge Sonic Wave from Somnus. They bound Fly Fly. Emo is falling low. Oli may also go down the old 11. He will change to Kaka instead. And Emo is caught out. Oh. Thank you for the glimpse. <laughs> so, not good news for IG. And just takes one team fight. That's all it literally took. They are smoked up. 
Okay, well, they kind of need to, right? Because they understand oh, their time is almost smoke. over. Yeah, smoke on smoke. Kaka needs the perfect static storm. He will end up getting Somnus. Roar is well being thrown out. Emo now jumping straight on that Queen of Pain. Somnus is still alive. They threw everything but the kitchen sink, but now Somnus blinks back in, or rather got glimpsed back in. He does go down. Old Eleven now looking to fight Flyfly. Fly. Chalice is also there. Flyfly Fly with that static link being very frustrating, but eventually it does wear off. And Chalice is unaffected. He will die. So you found Somnus. That took so much committal though. It's gonna be blocked out if you're not careful. And they've been super on point, IG, with getting that stun onto Somnus. If they don't spot this out, well, it's not gonna work out. Thankfully, Somnus does end up destroying the Fairy Fire that was left in the Roshan pit by IG. <laughs> cleaning up their trash. Meanwhile, IG gonna come in. Static oh. Storm is gonna be decent on Chalice. They do also have Somnus there in the Queen of Pain, but it does wear off. Sonic Wave flies through. Roshan still falling. Flyfly Fly gonna try and steal. He does take the Aegis on Chalice. The song was there just in case, and now they look to run out and maybe re-engage. LDD, yeah, they're going oh. back in. Flyfly Fly gonna be the target. A great Sonic Wave onto three heroes from Somnus. Yeah, I don't blame him. Their, their time is IG. over. Like their power spike oh, yeah. was was five minutes ago. They took it way too slow, and IG. I mean, it, it's 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 a rough situation, right? You just went from a long series. You jump into this one.